A lot of people said Nico's living room was a budget living room. And he deserves the best, so I'm redoing the entire thing. A lot of people didn't like my DIY couch, so I'm throwing that out. And the TV from the 70s has to go. Honestly, his white walls were pretty boring, so I'm moving everything out of the room, and I'm gonna redo the walls. The renovation was really stressing Nico out, so he left his apartment. Nico told me that he really likes this design for the walls. And the material was really expensive, so that's gonna raise his rent when I'm done with the renovation. I was gonna throw away the DIY curb couch, but then I found Nico laying on And he wouldn't let me get rid of it. It. Since we weren't getting rid of the couch, that left money in the budget for other furnishings to be upgraded. I found this wood piece at Five Below for $325 and I made a little end table out of it. I don't really know what this is, but Nico really liked it. A lot of people requested that I put photos in the living room and Nico made me put a picture of his girlfriend. I wonder why I haven't met her yet. In this photo, I think Nikki interrupted Nico as he was talking. Nico would like to dedicate this video to his brother Milo, who's waiting for us at Rainbow Bridge. We love you, Milo. Nico deserved a flat screen and I found one laying around, but I forgot the code. I really hope Nico doesn't want to watch TV anytime soon. Should I renovate Nico's bathroom or kitchen first?